Hello, welcome to my slimming vlog, Tony slimming vlog, week 22 and 23. Obviously I weren't here last week, I uh, apologise for that, but real life seemed to get in the way, as it does, um, too busy really just to do a quick vlog and just to let you know. That with what I did last week, um, I seemed a bit disappointed, um, I had to maintain, um, I did fall off the rails a bit, but you know, I thought, I wasn't in the right place to do a vlog and without the time um, hence no vlog last week um, as I've just said maintained last week so I wasn't over the moon with it but it was it was to be expected this week um, if you follow me on my other platforms you will know I've had an amazing week as in trying to be fit and keeping to plan um, and I managed to get a two pound loss this week so um, a bit chuffed with that. I was aiming a lot higher. Um, I set myself a target of four and a half because that's my three stone award. Um, two pounds. I'm a, I'm okay with that. You know, to be honest, 22 weeks, 23 weeks into this, to be losing two pounds with what I'm doing, we all like more. Two pounds is a lot to lose. I'm getting very close now to my obviously my three stone award. I'm two and a half pounds away from it. But I'm also was it five and a half or six pounds away from my target that I set myself back in September. Back then it seemed a long, long way, a long, a long journey. I thought it'd take me a long, a lot longer to get there. Not that I'm there yet, but I'm nearly there. Um, but I'm chuffed with the speed of what I've done and the transformation within my body, my fitness, my health, my family life. Everything seems to be changing. For the better um, and I feel better so it just shows you know when you get enough courage enough willpower to actually decide you want to do something like this and to change your life then it works out quite well so I'm chuffed um, went to group yesterday um, a lot of new faces there again um, not that I don't go by the way anyone who's just coming into this I go every week just sometimes I only stay every other week but at the moment I've been staying just to keep my motivation up, to keep my willpower going and to keep me on track um, to make sure I don't fall. Um, this week, together with quite a lot of exercise, I filled out a the online diary with Slimming World, which I've, I'll be honest, I've not done a diary for ages. You do it for the first four weeks, and then you tend to stop. And it was interesting doing it, because I think I know what I'm doing. Now I'm getting the results. But by doing a diary just for the few days last week, I realised I'm not having my healthy beans. Not all, you know, all the time. It's when you think, oh, I'm not going to have bread, or I'm not going to have, you know, your cereal. I realised I was cutting it out completely, not having it. So, doing a diary sometimes, even for the more experienced slimmers out there, it does work. You know, although you're thinking I don't want to have my sin, sometimes you're not eating enough food, um, which has an effect with you not work, you know, not losing. Um, this week at group, um, I spotted one of these things. Nice apron, which is now looking like a twit because I can't bloody get it right. There we are. My apron. Now, Slimming World are doing these. Um, I think our consultants flogging them, selling them, sorry, for ninety five. Um, me being me, I spotted one. Yeah, it's quite handy. Nice little pouch, but good for the kitchen. Good laugh. Also has the logo, Slimming World. You know, love you love food actually not love you um makes me laugh makes me chuckle you know don't have to be serious all the time um i know we're here last week but again not too much to say uh, nice to see a couple of old faces back on the uh, vlogs um my old friend mcsaucy's back well done mate um just a quick message for you forget what other people say remember why you're doing it you're doing it for you um same as me i'm doing this for me if we're all worried about what everyone else says, none of us would ever do anything. Um, it takes a lot of balls to get in front of one of these cameras and do this. Um, so for the people that sort of maybe knock your back or well, laugh at you for when you do these or when they see them, screw them. Um, it's about how you feel, you know. I've learned over my 23 weeks, this is a bloody good image therapy, especially when you start looking back because I've said it throughout my vlogs when you see yourself every day you don't see yourself getting thinner this week I went through my wardrobe 
through all my large clothes away with the help of the missus, went through a block bag, it's all gone to a charity shop. It was a case of I need to go through it. I was in the mindset where I keep it, I always have kept all my stuff because I don't know, deep side, deep down inside I thought maybe one day I'll get back up there but I'm now at the mindset of, you know, this is my lifestyle now. I've changed my eating, I've changed what I do and I prefer it. I like being skinnier, um, I like being healthier and I'm going to continue so my line as it were that I drew last week was all my old clothes, all my big clothes, gone. So my wardrobe's now empty. <laughs> Um, I've got a few small clothes which I'm starting to wear um, in between shirts but it's it's nice when it starts to go it really is when you can see a big improvement when you see people you've not met for a while who go bloody hell you know you're changing it's it's a good journey to start put it that way I'm happy um, I hope you're a lot happy um, you've seen me now over 23 weeks changing I don't know what's going to happen um, although when I started my vlogs I want to continue doing this for a long time um, and I thought I would do um, when I get to my goal you know six pounds away I might change my goal make myself a little bit more thinner I do not know um, your feedback would be nice you know would I be too thin you know my goal was 14 stone I'm six pounds away from it will I be too thin would I look you know as you've seen me on my journeys would I look too thin um, I know it's about what I want, but it's also, you know, how people perceive you. You know, they think, oh, look at him, a bit too skinny. Um, I don't know. Um, we will see. But when I get to Target, I may have to do some other vlogs about trying to keep at Target because that's going to be my next, my next issue. You know, losing weight seems fairly easy. Putting weight on is very easy. Everyone can do that. But maintaining week in, week out, I think after about four weeks, of, which I think is what's going to take me to get to where I am or where I want to be, I think that's when the fun's going to start, how to maintain. I've not seen any vlogs on people maintaining, to be honest. Everyone's losing weight. Some people are building muscle, doing fitness. But I don't know, I don't recall of anyone I've seen who is constantly maintaining and who has maintained so if there is anyone who watches my vlogs who watches anyone else who's at Slimming World and who is maintained constantly for uh, um, six months a year please send me the link um, so I can watch them just to see because I know when you're losing weight if you go off the rails I know what to do you know to get back on track but when you're maintaining you've got to stop yourself from losing and stop yourself from gaining to a degree so it's I don't know. It's the next thing to get my head around, so we will see. Um, bit of a manic vlog this week, so I apologise, but um, maybe a bit more structure next week. Every time I'm doing these vlogs, I have a million things going through my head that I want to do. 99% of the time, I never do it, um, because I just want to get my message out there that I've lost. I'm still here. I'm still working on it. Um, I'm still on the journey. Um... I will see you next week. I hope you enjoy. Bye.